are getting the our uh, cleansing our body and we are becoming healthy. So, when somebody got the punishment of the hanging punishment, hang. How long? Three minutes. They put on the hang in three minutes. After the three minutes, within three minutes, they check the pulse is zero, nothing. Then they stop it and they died. Do you know why? As two uh, who, who are, we are giving the punishment to that hanging, everybody that time will be too much stress. Isn't it? There will be too much stress. And stress is comes from the thought. And stress is becoming toxins. Huge toxins frequency in the cell inside. When you block the, take, not talking the oxygen, what will happen? The toxins are came out from the cell, outside the cell, and it covered the, all the cells. After that, when you lose it, Though at that time, oxygen still you can have, but it cannot reach to cell to cell. But that time you will die. So that is the process that we breathe. Why? The, through the air, through the oxygen, we, are, we can keep on our health. Another will die. That's why this philosophy is coming. Air is a prana. But Without breath also people can survive in Samadhi stage? In Samadhi stage? Hours together? That's why magicians, when you are putting on the under the soil, sometime three days after we are taking off, that's the Siddhi. It's all science. They have a Siddhi power, how long they can be stay outside. It also on the spiritual journey, but they are took only for the magic purpose. So that's why they are not peaceful in their life. Though they have developed one big technique. Could you understood? So spirituality will give you peaceful or journey when you are using for the natural way. It's not for sowing. It is not for attracting, not for to our magic. So, and when, why it is possible? When we take the samadhi experience, then all the toxins from the body, toxins we are throwing outside. So body will be free of the toxins. And body is the free of the toxins, then all the cells are clean. And when you take back oxygen, and it can work immediately because body was toxin free. That's why without breath also we can sustain in the samadhi stage. So what we what do you want to say now? This, this don't break me in the my mood. So you see now. How we can utilize in the breath and do the reach to the pranayama stage. Pranayama means actually samadhi stage. And from where we have started journey to reach to the samadhi, one direction that way we used to say pranayama. Suppose we have to reach to Delhi, we have to go to Delhi. We have a ticket. We are going towards the airport. And we started journey to go to Delhi and we, if we did, if we think we reached with Delhi, is it the same? Is it the same? Just we are going towards the airport and we are started travel for the Delhi. Are we reached Delhi? So, this pranayama is started journey towards the Delhi, means to reach to the Samadhi. Yet, target is Delhi means Samadhi here. So, are we reached to the Samadhi? No. 
when we can continue our journey and succeed to reach to the delhi then it will be completed so breathing technique also can lead you to the pranayama stage to reach to the samadhi stage but when we started to the breathing technique that is not the pranayama could you understood now breathing technique has to be do by proper guidance another it could be very very danger so many peoples i saw i know they read from the book collect from the net and they themselves try it is a very danger it is very very danger and suppose i will i will see what is danger is there four type of breathing techniques there is so many techniques are there but it's four uh, root is there and then we can reach to the samadhi experience through the breathing technique first step is the anulom vilom anulom vilom means breathe in and immediately breathe out full lungs breathe in and full lungs breathe out don't hold if you continue breathe in and breathe out breathe out and breathe in then you will generate the energy your inside your mind also will be little cool thought will be less so we are preparing our ground so that's why it also part of the pranayama means beginning begins of the pranayama this is not much tough this things normally normally we can do but sec next step that is the little higher call purak kumbak rechak so purak kumbak rechak so purak is breathe in kumbak is uh, holding and rechak is breathe out there is a ratio 1 is to 4 is to 2 so if we take breathe in 1 minute 4 minute hold it and through minute you take it out is it not a danger if you have a not proper body can be exist uh, tolerate is it not a danger it is very dangerous as we saw the hanging part 3 minutes after will die so if we are our body is clean then it is okay but is it easy normally we can clean our body and then do it so that's a proper guidance are required there it's not wrong but you need to the proper guidance and you have to be properly utilize and it could be little tough but you can next another one is rechak fast then kumbhak then purak that also the same ratio one is to 4 is to 2 ratio means 1 minute you breathe out don't take breath 4 minutes and breathe in with 2 minutes is it not a much danger breathe in still you can hold certain time because oxygen is there oxygen is there you can still sustain some time but breathe out there is no oxygen and you have to hold it so and they four minutes and then you can take the breath for two minutes is it not a danger it is extreme danger if we are not proper guided 
and that is the third step pranayama still it is not reached to the samadhi still that formula that practice cannot lead to you samadhi after when you will be habituated this then there is a extreme one that called the keval kumbhakam means you take the breath hold it for unlimited time there will be no time taboo when you can breathe out breathe in and hold it that called the keval kumbhak is it not a danger when you will able to keval kumbhak then only you will able to create your atmosphere to reach to the samadhi experience so this is very very dangerous things but some of the step already you cross when you were looking the sun sometime you are forgetted how long you are not breathing are you in the danger so here automatically naturally it is growing so you are not focusing so you are crossing slow by slowly in beyond the danger so here you need not to do this breathing technique automatically it is naturally is going to your inside and you need not to focus to there if you focus then you are danger if you focus on the breath then you are in the danger so here just looking the sun is enough when we are looking the sun then we were breathless for certain time isn't it we were breathing or not we were not aware of that so that time and that time all the five element we started getting balance remember and what was the happen next and when we we are looking to this still that sun then one peaceful atmosphere was started in the anahata chakras that means peace seed is started sprouting this seed we are putting in the peace it is peace cannot be draw cannot be uh, uh, showing but it is for the understanding we are putting the seed is started sprouting means peace is started coming we were in the blissful peaceful in the heart and there will be one very nice rhythm how it will be what kind of rhythm will come you see as still water pond and if you throw one stone on the water what will happen one ripples will come and similarly it was in our heart our thoughtless condition we have we are there thought is a stone and drop in the that our unconditional love ocean inside that's way it started give the unconditional love are we at that time unconditional love or not so our unconditional love there is no condition what i will get what i will get and what i will give or there was no condition it was the unconditional vibes it was coming and that was make us blissful peaceful that that means it was started anahata chakras awakening chakra started awakening chakras three exercise are there chakras opening chakra darshan and chakras awakening chakra opening exercise if we do then if energy will be come out from your chakra sometime body cannot tolerate sometime kundalini will be awakening and without your body tolerance if kundalini will be awakening it could become a mad it can be choked your brain 
It could be choked your any organs. So that's why that uh, chakras opening exercise we will give you advanced course. Not in the basic course. We gave only exercise we gave the how to remove the toxins from the joints and from the muscles. So toxins energy also existing on the chakras and that is the huge amount. But that cannot be clean and beginning. And if it will be clean and open up that energy, you cannot hold, physical body is not able to tolerate. So that's why that will have to be in the advanced course. Chakra darshan also will be give you energy. That's why chakra darshan and chakras uh, opening exercise will give you in advanced course. But here chakras awaking is started natural way. Natural way. So it is no danger. And chakras awaking, awaking can be done. It's natural process. It will start from the Anahata chakras. Chakras opening, chakras darshan, you can jump one chakras to other chakras. But chakras awaking, you cannot do. Chakras awaking is a natural formula, natural way it will come. When you will balance your frequency with the natural frequency, then only it will be become awaking. So, any kind of practice you do, any kind of practice you do, when your frequency will be matching, that will be start awaking from the Anahata Chakra. Because this is the center chakras. Upper three chakras, lower three chakras. So this is the balanced chakras. So this is the center chakras of the body. So that's why it will be when we saw the triangle also where we started receive the energy on the center. So this is the body if we are receiving the frequency from where we will receive from the center. So anahata chakras will be awaking. Now when Anahata Chakras is awaking, three material diseases will getting balancing. Same, hatred, fear. Lajja, Grena, Bhai. Same, sinus. We are not giving important. Oh, sinus is good, no? Child should be sigh. Everything should not be talk. Aside, yes, some percentage of the sinus is good. But if I look the sun, if I do the sun yoga, what my neighbor will say? I should not do. That also sinus. Could you understood? If I do the sun yoga or if I do this yoga, if I do the spiritual, uh, uh, my practice, what my neighbor will say? Nobody is practicing there, is surrounding you. And if you do the practice, it is filling one sinus you are inside or not? Is it good? Is it good? It is blocking to your higher journey or not? So sinus also blocking our spiritual journey. But after the Anatha Chakras awaking, you will not, you are please. So sinus slowly it will go away. You will confidently do. Somebody will say or not. Somebody will see or not. Somebody will feel something or not. That's not mine. I do feel good. I'm balancing myself. So I'll do. So sinus will getting balancing and it will not blocking to us. Hating. Normally we are hating, no? He is not right. This, 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 that. that we are used to right, hating to others. Isn't it? Something we are hating, some person we are hating. I should not meet, I should not touch to him or I, her or I should not be, uh, I am something, I am something great. And so I have to be uh, avoiding, we used to do or not. That means I, uh, hating, it is also one quality of the hating, which to whom we are hating. To whom we are hating? Hating to myself, no? Through you? 
Is it right? Is it right? No. Slowly, hating will go away. Just remind the first day when you came to here, all of you, and now, is it the same situation, all of your connection, internal connection? It's in how big difference. Are we not feeling the one family member? Are we not feeling to heart to heart connection? That means our hating has been over. Our hate is slowly going away. Now we are accepting. Hating is rejecting. Am I right? Hating nature is rejecting. And acceptance is opposite. That means we started accepting all of us or not. That means we are overcoming the hating nature. Because of our Anahata Chakras are started awaking. Thank you.